Hi, I'm Perfecto Martinez, Technical Marketing Manager for Aero Electronics, and I'll be going over all the basics for setting up the 3D Time of Fly Evaluation Kit, available for purchase on Aero.com. Time of Fly technology is gaining traction for a variety of applications requiring real-time depth mapping. Example use cases are industrial safety and automation, autonomous guided vehicles, object detection and classification, virtual and augmented realities, and drones. The kit starts with the ADI Time of Flight mezzanine card, which includes a power supply and bootable SD card for the Dragonboard 410C. Additionally, you'll need to order a Dragonboard 410C and power supply and a mini tripod to support the electronics. For this setup, we'll also be using an HDMI monitor plus keyboard and mouse with a wireless USB dongle. We will be running the software that ships pre-programmed on the SD card. To get started, insert the SD card into the Dragon Board until you hear a click. To boot from the SD card, toggle the dip switch on the back of the Dragon Board. Mate the Dragon Board and Time of Flight boards like so. Remove the lens cover. Then mount the boards to the tripod as you would a small camera using the mount included. You can stream to your PC, but for this setup, we're connecting directly to a monitor with HDMI here. We are adding keyboard and mouse through a wireless USB dongle. Note the power jacks on each board here and here, as well as a laser board power switch. Holding the board like this, power the laser board on. You should see the LED illuminate. Now power up the Dragon Board and check that its LED is lit as well, and you're ready to go. On the monitor, you'll see the Linux desktop with TOF application script. Launch the evaluation app from the desktop. Once booted, you'll have several options, but for now, let's go ahead and start with the live playback by pressing play. Immediately, you should see two images from the camera. One is the IR image from the CCD sensor, and the other is the depth image. The depth data is displayed as a color map ranging from warm to cold colors as the distance from the camera increases. A point in the middle of the depth image shows the distance in millimeters to the target. There are three operating modes the user can select that determine the range of the system. Near, 25 centimeters to 80 centimeters, medium, 80 centimeters to 3 meters, and far, 300 centimeters to 600 centimeters. You can record a live stream and play it back later. A visual center point can be enabled giving the user distance measurement. Background noise can be removed by enabling the small signal removal feature. Using the open source SDK available, you're now ready to start your own projects. The SDK provides bindings for MATLAB, Open3D, OpenCV, and Python. The SDK is continuously being updated, so check back often for updates. For more information, visit aero.com slash 3DTOF or analog.com slash TOF.